dead man. That's it. Interesting. Death by cramming. You know, they have a cure for that now. Uh, uh, it's called studying as you go along. Thank you, Dr. Uber Achiever. It's just, it's not fair. If we were there five minutes sooner. Val, forget it. This had lost cause written all over it. We should just let go and move on. You know, life's too short. Hey, guys, I know we're supposed to stay emotionally detached from our work, but uh, life's too short? No, no, no. Tyler and I were talking about our sociology class. We were late, and so we got last pick on a project due Friday. Marketing and the American public. Yeah, we have to make a product out of something she assigns us and then try to sell it to the public. Bad news, guys. City inspection next week. I called Alex, who gave me the go-ahead to make a cleaning schedule. Well, wait, 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 wait. Shouldn't Alex be in on this? He's out with a bad back. Oh, and just in time for a major cleanup. How can be? No, no, no. This back thing is chronic with Alex. It happens every time it rains. Should have seen him last time. Yes, master. <laughs> ah! Somebody's out there. I don't get it. He was right there. Excuse me? Mr. Revere. I'm surprised you remembered. Hey, Mr. Revere, my name is Hank. Uh, we rescued Mr. Revere from the MVA a few months ago. Didn't you have a little boy in the car with you? My son, Sam. I, I thought he was OK. Since the accident, he's been, uh, he's been real quiet. He still has nightmares, you know, about the crash. His therapist thinks he's he's overwhelmed. But she said uh, it might really do Sam some good if he could spend some time with you. Me? Why, why me? The only time he ever talked about the accident, he just said one word, Hank. Hank. Yeah, sir, I, mean, I don't think that. You uh, see, EMTs have this rule against getting involved with people that have helped. Nothing else has worked. I've got some free time tomorrow. Yeah, say around 3 o'clock. 3 o'clock is great. Here's the address. Sam will be waiting. Thanks. Hank, shouldn't you talk to Alex about this? <laughs> Why? You know, I'll be away from the station on my own time. You know, besides, it's a good cause. You, know, you don't get in trouble for doing good. <laughs> Five minutes late for class, we get stuck using this trash. OK, I agree. It's not much to work with, but I don't know. That's what makes it so Lame? Bogus? Challenging. Challenging, right. <laughs> OK, let's see. I'm product. Uh, Ricky the stick, <laughs> the most versatile toy. You can swing him. He's a bat. You can uh, twirl him. He's a baton or a hiking stick or uh, a limbo pole. Or not. Well, ah! what is it? What's wrong? Brooke, you almost scared me to death with that thing. Well, maybe, maybe if I had some help here, it wouldn't have happened. Brooke, we told you we can help you as soon as we're done our schoolwork. Which means we'll be scrambling like always. I just wanted to get a jump on things for a change, that's all. Brooke, we're sorry. This is due Friday. You're going to have to wait. <sighs> Come on, Serena. Looks like we dummies are doing the cleaning. Come on, get his crooked dress. I know this. I know this. I'll give you a hint. It doesn't have a zip code. <laughs> Funny. My history grade's reaching critical mass, and you're making jokes. 
You think cleaning this place all by myself is funny? Well, it's gotta be better than stuffing your brain with the Civil War for three days. Three days? Please. I mean... I'm no expert on the Civil War, but give me your textbook and let me coach you. I could have you ready in half the time. Really? You do that? Why? What's in it for you? Simple. I help you study to pass your test, and you help me start cleaning to pass inspection. Deal? Deal. Uh, sorry we couldn't go to the park. Still, going for ice cream's not such a bad fallback plan, is it? So, here your favorite flavor is Rocky Road. Your dad says that you really haven't talked much, you know? Since the accident. Join the ranks of James Bond, Austin Powers, and, and lots of other very famous undercover agents with your very own secrets. Agent Spy Spool. Look through it for isolated surveillance. Talk through it and tell secrets that no one else can hear. <laughs> Tyler! Tyler, oh, I'm so sorry. That was just, it was, that was really close. Are you okay? Are you okay? What? I said, are you okay? Because when I was talking through this, you, you, when I, <laughs> get out. <laughs> what Confederate general won his nickname for his stand at Bull Run? Bull somebody. Thomas Stonewall Jackson, it's right here. Jackson, I always forget that guy. It's like I've got a mental block against him. Well, then what you need is a way to trigger your memory. A mental block is sort of like a stone wall, right? And Stonewall was Jackson's nickname. So whenever you hit that mental block, all you need to do is think... Stonewall, Thomas Stonewall. Thomas Stonewall... Watch his face. <sighs> okay, bye, Alex. What is it? What's wrong? National Weather Service is advising everyone to stay off the roads. Centennial Bridge is already closed. So much for reinforcements. Yeah. And Alex wants us all to stay on duty. He's expecting lots of storm-related calls. He wants me to page Hank. Yeah, don't worry, we'll touch the bridge soon. No time to just hang over to my house, okay? Okay, parents, you're a-okay. Ooh. You seem pretty close, huh? Oh, it's funny, huh? I used to be scared of storms, too. Yeah, I'd, I'd, I'd build forts out of whatever. You know, blanket and sheets, uh, uh, table and chairs. Empty boxes were the best, though. Then I'd just crawl inside and stay there till the storm passed. It's the only place I really felt safe. You know what I mean? Are you insane? You, you know, Sam, my... But after all that riding around, you really could use the bathroom, huh? Just straight through there. Boy, Mr. Revere wasn't kidding. I've heard more sound from a mime. I tried to take him home, but the bridge was closed. And my parents aren't home, so I couldn't take him there either. What other choice did I have? <laughs> Poor kid. Poor us if Alex hears about it. We better hope Alex never finds out. Finds out what? Something is going on around here. So what is it that you guys don't want me to find out? Well, the truth is, we have Sam. Sam, Sam, Salmonella reports. Salmonella. Uh, yeah, that's right. It must be from all the backed up storm drains. Uh, yeah, yeah, but uh, I bet we see a rise in all kinds of food poisoning. And how come you didn't want me to find this out? Because, um, uh, we know how much you love a good meal. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, what brings you in on a day like this? I heard you had a bad back. It's getting worse, but I couldn't ask you guys to pull a double shift and not help. Sure, in your condition, sure. you could do that. No, no, we can if the storm it. settles in, the phones are going to be ringing off the hook. We're never going to get away with this. He's going to find out. I'm sure I want to understand if we explain. Hey, what if no, we... It's not like I planned on the bridge being closed. You know, it's really not too hard. It's to rocks. Just... You guys lied to Alex. Quiet! Look, 
it's simple. Hank will watch Sam while the rest of us keep doing whatever we're doing. If Alex comes around, Hank will pass Sam to whoever's open till Alex is gone. If there's a call, I'll watch Sam till you guys are back. We clear? Yeah. Good. Now let's get busy. Come on, Jamie. Back to the trenches. Hey, we've got to come up with a product soon. Have you given any thought to my Danny Dustcloth idea? I've come up with a prototype. See, it's Danny Dustcloth, the dashing new way to get rid of dust and, and grime. What are you doing? Well, I still think my werewolf wipe has brought a repute. Werewolf wipe? Werewolf wipe? Ah, werewolf wipe. No, it's too many W's. Hank, would you give me a hand? I dropped an aspirin and I can't find it. Sure, sure. No, 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 no problem. It's, uh, it's around here someplace. Mm, okay. I think it rolled under the desk. Oh. No, Sam, the truth is that we're both on the run. You from Alex and me from Attila the Tudor. Jamie? Jamie, are you in here? Thanks, buddy. I owe you. She's killing me with all the trigger words in her memory system. You know, the funny thing is, is that I actually know most of this war stuff. It's just every time I sit down to take a history test, it freeze up. It's weird, huh? You think it's nerves? No? I mean, you. You gotta admit, it's ironic, though. Me and my big brother Peter, Peter the Perfect, he actually aced history. I can't even make it through a test. It's like I know I'm doomed from the beginning. Maybe that's it. Maybe that's why I can't finish a test. I quit before I even start. Yeah, Alex, please don't go to the storage closet in the garage. Why are you shouting? I'm right here. Because I don't think you should be looking through old files in your condition. I hurt my back, not my brain. Yeah, but uh, you shouldn't push. Where's Sam? Thanks, Jamie. I, I got him now. Yeah, no sweat, man. He's a deep little dude. Hey, Hank, uh, is that you? Alex. Uh, uh, did the aspirin help? No, my back is killing me. I can't even straighten up. Should it, shouldn't you be resting? Yeah, it's funny. The phone's been really quiet. When this guy named Revere calls on a cellular, it broke up really quick, but he says he got your message and he's sure that Sam is in good hands. Do you have any idea what he might have meant by that? These hands are empty. Yeah, <sighs> must have been some kind of a crank. Hey, Hank, is that, is that Tyler with you? Uh, y yeah, who else? Good, I need you guys to come in here and give me a hand moving something, okay? Uh huh? Get something like this file cap and look where it is. <clears throat> okay, so. Okay, have a seat, Sam. You hungry? You want something to drink? No? Oh, yeah, Tyler and I are working on a project. We have to make something out of that. Something somebody might want to buy. Um, for instance, Ricky the Stick. The world's most versatile toy. Um, you can swing him, he's a bat. Um, twirl him, he's a baton or a hiking stick or a limbo bar. Wait, what, what, what do you think? Yeah, me too. But some of Tyler's other ideas, they're worse. But the thing is, I really, I like him. I mean, you know, as, as a friend. So I don't want to hurt his feelings, but I don't want a bad grade either. So what do I do? Do I keep quiet? So we can stay friends, or do I tell him the truth? Val, heads up. Alex's back is making him nuts. Hank's in there pulling files right now. He sent me out here to get your response log. Don't worry, I'll uh, take care of Sam till Hank's free. Val, where's the logbook? I'm coming. So, Val tell you about our product? Yeah. What we really need is a good product, you know? Uh, like this super cool secret agent spy tool. You know, you look through it, it's uh, surveillance. You can talk into it, risk going deaf. It's 
Sorry. So, what do you think? Could you buy it? No, me neither. So, what do I do? You know, say her idea stinks? Lie? Say nothing? So, Sam, don't, don't let the noise scare you. It's, uh, it's like a, an alarm clock, only louder. Uh, Brooke here will uh, hang out with you till we get back, okay? It'll stop soon. What I tell you, peace and quiet. Brooke, go stop this squad. It's a false alarm. Catch them before they leave. Okay. You just stay over here, okay? I won't be long. Um, in fact, I'll be right back, okay? I can't believe her only call today is a false alarm. I guess people are being smart, staying put. Okay, where's Sam? I don't know. I gave him to you. Then I passed him to Tyler. We passed him to Val. Yeah, then I gave him back to Tyler. True. When the alarm went off, I gave him to Brooke. I, I said I'd be right back. You left him alone? Okay, he's probably scared. I mean, maybe he hid somewhere. Okay, let's split up and go look for him. Can we have just one more search? Sam must be so scared. In a strange place so nothing feels safe. Okay, come on. I didn't have Ricky the stick with me. Clobber someone needs a weapon. <laughs> <laughs> when you say it like that, it kind of sounds stupid. Yeah, almost as dumb as my secret agent spy spool or my Danny dishcloth. <laughs> okay, how about after we're done finding Sam, we go back to the drawing board? You're on. Wow. This fort is beyond cool, Sam. It's super cool. And I should know I've made a zillion of them. That's how I finally knew where to find you. I thought of our talk, remember, about being scared and storms. Remember? But the thing is, is things happen all the time, Sam. Uh, some things that are bad, and some things that are good, and some things that just make us scared like a storm. On accidents. I felt scared that night too, Sam. Scared that you may be hurt for the rest of your life. But for a moment I froze. Caught the fear just like you are. But it's okay to be afraid sometimes, Sam. Everyone is. But you gotta let it go. And talking about it is a lot better than walling it up inside of you like a fort. You know? So what do you say? You want to try it? Just you and me. Are you cool with that? Super cool. <laughs> Super cool. <laughs> Brooke, congratulate us. You were looking at the dynamic duo who got an A on their marketing project. You're kidding. Uh, no offense, but I thought your ideas were, like, the worst. Oh, they were. But then Tyler came up with this great plan to embrace that by combining them all into one product. Danny, do it all. See, Val came up with the name, but what really sold it was the marketing. You gotta check it out. Hey, you ready? <laughs> so sit right down. We're here to tell you all the story. About a do-it-all and Danny, Andy, do it all for glory. He's here to help you serve if you're mixing up a pie. Or a big old ugly swatter if you're bringing down a fry. Be a spy, touch the sky. Hold it up and wave bye-bye. Danny does a do it all, do it all, do it all. He does, does a it. Do it all, do it all, do it all. He can be there wiping dirt or be a color for your shirt. He's a way to get a boy or a puppa kind of toy. A reaching lower, reaching higher, Danny does what you desire. He is everything to make your heart go sing. 
He is the one and the only major multi-trick pony. And my friends, that's no baloney, so do not accept a phone. Only Danny. I do it all, do it all, do it all. Danny does I it. do it all, do it all, do it all. He does, that does it. Call an order yours today. Word to the toll-free number. So? So? So it's the bomb. Yeah? I mean that more ways than one. Says the man who's flunking history. Not anymore. You passed the test? Even better. I finished it. Mr. Tate, he almost dropped his teeth when he found out I made a B plus. Cutting it close, Beecham. Yeah, I stopped by the Revere's to see Sam. <laughs> the kid wouldn't shut up so I could leave. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. OK, who's up for pizza? Not so fast. They're still cleaning to do before the city inspection. Um, unless, of course, you'd rather Alex find out all the details of how you guys tricked him. Good point. Good point. Thanks for the idea. Work like a charm. It's my pleasure. Ha, 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 ha.